Peggy 18. This is the last stand. This is brothers to the end. You and your couple buddies are all that's left. This is kind of the end of this trilogy for these characters. We wanted this story to have a conclusion. We didn't want to end on a cliffhanger. Everything builds to this fever pitch of chaos. Gears of War 1 was really about a battle. Gears of War 2 wanted you to feel like you're part of a war. With Gears of War 3, we wanted to take the scale of the story down, make it personal. Marcus, I've developed a solution for the Lambent problem. But it's also a, very much a father-son story. Please. It's your father. Listen. Yeah, I know. It's Imagine what it feels like to hear a voice from beyond the grave. Yeah! I, myself, lost my dad when I was like 15. Rod Ferguson lost his dad, so did Lee Perry. We are actually making this personal. That we latched onto is we're all stranded now. Society's collapsed, the government's collapsed, and you're really just basically surviving. Everybody's on the run. Humans are on the run, locusts are on the run. There's no army anymore, there's no COG military, it's all been destroyed. What happens if the world goes apocalyptic? We really focus on low tech weapons. Yeah! Even our new turret is just rifles. Four lancers that are strapped down into one mount. To drive, who wants to cover? We have this giant exosuit known as a silverback. And then tromp around and kind of take out your foes. This is the longest campaign Epic has ever produced for a single player game. Anyone up for a hijack? We have a whole bunch of different locations, beautiful areas, the areas that aren't so pretty. Any idea where we are now? Um, in the shit, up to here. There are these characters that we've been around for so long. You really feel like you're gonna miss these people. Are you okay, Cole? Ah, the train still got the moves, baby. Cole Train is somebody who brings levity to a lot of situations. At the same time, Cole is one of the most serious characters. I mean, he gets to return back to his stadium, seeing what was lost for him. With the loss of his children on E-Day and then the loss of his wife, I think Dom has slightly changed. When you look at Anya going from a dispatcher to a soldier, it's all been this journey. This is where it ends, one way or another. We're really watching these final scenes that have played out in front of us at the end of the trilogy. It's hard to not get a little attached to the characters, the universe, and everything that goes on in it.